This is the fact today we're going to be talking about My Hero Academia Season 7, Episode... Episode 7, I think? So this episode was crazy. This episode started off with, like, going over the plan again. You know how anime does. They do flashbacks, but at least it's not, like, really long flashbacks. And there's just, there's just a lot. There's a lot. So... I mean, there's not a lot, but there's also a lot. So this, these are like quick, re it's like rundowns and like how I thought of the episode. So yeah, that's what these videos are. If people were confused, like why I don't go in depth, it's just like going over what happens. So again, spoilers, let's get into it. So uh, Mirko, I think that's her name, loses her arm. And I was like, it went by so fast that, like, you don't even notice it. But, yeah, she loses her arm. She gets guns for an arm, which is awesome. Uh, her and Bakugo almost fight, but then uh, they have to focus on Shigaraki. Uh, Deku is not there, uh, which was not a part of the plan. So, yeah. Uh, they're basically... They're, they're, they're basically screwed. They're basically screwed. And... We cut to... Um, Himiko Toga's side of things. And she almost... Almost is winning. Well, not... Well, kind of. She stabbed Ochako, but, like, and then she stops for a moment to, to ask Deku to, like, be her boyfriend. And it's just, like, I get it, but it's, like, she doesn't want to, she doesn't really want him to be her boyfriend. He wants, or she wants to be him, which, like, that's not love. Even though, like, it's confirmed that she has a crush on Deku. It's it's weird. It's a weird realm of stuff. Um, but eventually, the heroes get the upper hand. And... And, yeah. So... Insane. Absolutely insane. Um, but then we cut to the final scenes. Where... Um, it's... Dobby and Shoto talking like they're gonna get ready to fight. Dobby is like like Shoto admits that he wants to beat Dobby. He wants to save his brother as Dobby is like burning up but he's still running and kicking. I really really hope that Dobby gets redeemed. That's my main that's the only that's my main wish in the entirety of the show. Screw the fact that I ship Toga and Dobby. Screw that. I just want Dobby to be redeemed. I think Dobby is one of the characters that deserves to be redeemed. It's like his right to be redeemed because like his father's such a piece of shit that like it's not even, it's it's essentially Endeavor's fault that Dobby was has turned into a villain. I know that it's like, oh, Broken by the World such a classic thing and that you should still be prosecuted. I agree that Dobby should be prosecuted for his crimes, but I think he should be redeemed and we should get a scene of him being redeemed, like coming out of jail and his family coming to visit him um, as he's walking out and like a big hug happens. And yeah, I doubt that we'll get that because, you know, you know, MHA isn't that type of show. But that's just, that's like my one wish throughout the entire, ever since Dobby became a character, that's my one wish, is that he would become a good guy. But it's, it's whatever. It's, it's not a big deal if it doesn't happen. It's just my, my fanboy, my Dobby fanboy heart really wants him to be redeemed. Unfortunately, I think we're going to get the thing where Dobby dies. I think we're going to get that story. He's burning up. 
like every every little bit of him is turning into the burnt skin and it's just it's going haywire for him which really is sad saddening i knew it was going to happen but like i hope they somehow fix him <laughs> because what are the chances that he's going to get redeemed while he looks like that but yeah but you can see that he is burning up and it's just it's sad but yeah so that's it really um what i thought about the episode i thought it was decent i thought it was a pretty good episode i give it a eight out of ten but i i bet you episode the next episode is going to be a nine out or a ten out of ten but they keep teasing us with a fucking showdown between Endeavor, Dobby, and Shoto. Like, stop it. Just give us the fight. But anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this breakdown. I liked the episode. It might be not people's favorite just because, like, of the whole... It took, like, h half of the episode, if not most of the episode, for the Toga fight to end. It didn't even end because Ochako is still going to be there. But yeah. Anyway, that's it for this review. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, share, subscribe, turn on notifications. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.